Keep calm. It's just mega fortune because it's brought to you by the Skype Game Show Network. The network where you get to see different varieties of game shows on each of our channels that you see on YouTube. And it's never we don't hear any of sexual jokes. That's a lie. Also, it's the only network where you get to hear a bunch of varieties of jokes and no family feud references. So let's begin the show, shall we? Here on Mega Forge, you'll experience the good. You want a million dollars? You want a you also experience dollars? the bad. Also, I make fortune, you'll experience the I ugly. I the timer, Yeti. Oh, shit. <laughs> and you'll see JVD barely. From the red ass. One more thing. My foot will be firmly planted up someone's ass. That person, Jackie, is leaving. As you see, folks, here's my pretty face. From Buffalo, New York, from the NG2C Network Studios, it is Mega Fortune! Wait, why the hell did I fucking say that? Because, well, I said that. But anyways, welcome to Mega Fortune, everybody. It's now time for our next episode here. But before we get started, we got our um, uh, audience member in the form of Steve K, 1987. What's up, everybody? Not much. Also, now let's get to our contestants, shall we? First off, we got is Mr. Least Fan 18. Time for the Vegas Fortune. Exactly. Then we got the returning champion two take total of $94,000. We'll sum it up that way. That is MC Chap. And we got our man in our third row, which is going to be BJMTV Canada. Hello, everybody. Howdy doody. But anyways, folks, before we get started with our game, you all know how this works, and we lost Cameron, but for, but since we lose Cam since Cameron Rowan just got internet troubles, we're going to have Steve take his place for now until his internet is fine. But anyways, y'all ready to get started? And we got Cam back. Okay. But anyways, ready to get started? Okay, Mark, what is your number, please? For your oh, dial pad. for uh, dial pads. Yeah. Here and I will try. Okay. All right, Cameron, what's your number? Zero. Okay, and Mr. Ben. Number six. Number six. And Mark, I didn't catch your number. What was it again? Seven. Seven one six. How lovely. What? Seven zero six, actually. Oh. That's Cameron's number zero. Yeah. I heard him with uh, my own ears. I heard it too. I have elephant ears. <clears throat> gotcha! I need 10,000 bucks. <laughs> Now. Okay, Bob, well, I'm kind of busy right now. I'll talk later. About over 6,000 6, 6, shy of making it to the tournament oh, champion. Okay. Had he solved the bonus round puzzle last night, he would have made it. Alright, well, anyways, I apologize about that, folks, but uh, we'll get started with our game right now. Okay, well, anyways, let's get started with our $1,000 question right now. Okay, for $1,000, name two game shows that had a video game based plot, aka theme. That was Ben. Uh, Smash TV and Super Smash TV. Um, um, that is that are, there are video games, but I'm talking about game show wise, so I'm gonna put that as incorrect. That was Mark. Uh, okay, I will say Nick Arcade is one. One. And Video and Arcade Top Ten. Um, you got the first one right, but there was a second one. So I'm gonna mark that as incorrect. So Cameron's back to you. You got the one right. Uh, but I don't have the other one. Okay, well, I'm gonna give the credit to Mark anyway since he got it right. So I'm gonna give him the thousand since he was almost there. The second one was Starcade. He got the first right. Okay. So I'm gonna give Mark credit for that. Alrighty then. What well, I've seen video. Oh, I'm 
I'm sorry. I've seen video on arcade top, top ten myself many times during while I was growing up. Nineteen ninety one to two thousand five, I think, on YTV up here in Canada, right? Uh, nineteen ninety one to two thousand six, actually. All right. Well, anyways, let's start with our two thousand dollar question. Okay, put this in order. Which of these games came out first, second, or third? Now I'm gonna shuffle the order. Demons to Diamonds, Paul, Space Invaders. Oh no, Demons to Diamonds, Pong, and Space Invaders. Put them all in order. Ben. Uh, Pong. That's first. Uh, Space Invaders. That's second. And uh, Demons of Diamonds. That is correct. You got two thousand dollars. You're gonna be starting off around right about now. Okay, so Ben's got two thousand dollars. We're gonna get started with our bank round. You all know how this works. No more in the chat box, please. And what's our bank at? It starts at uh, two thousand dollars, and Steve's gonna keep score. Oh, Alright, you all know how the bank round works. There's a category. Category is video game title. Uh, Mr. Ben's gonna be signing off. He's in blue. Mark's in the red, and yet again, Cameron's in the yellow. Let's begin right now. Ben, you ready to give the wheel a spin? Yes, I am. You landed on the surprise wedge. Okay, give me an N, as in Nathaniel Hawthorne. You're going to get one N that is worth $500 for that surprise wedge. Um. Okay, there is your N. What would you like to do now, sir? I think I'll spin again. Okay, let's spin it again. Oh, it's a bankrupt on the $10,000 wedge. Dang. So we got to take that surprise away. So next, Mark, your turn. Ready to get the wheel spin? Spin. I love it when you do that, Gary. Thank you. 500. Let's have a T, please. You're going to get one T. Okay, there's your one T. What would you like to do now? Um, okay, not what I thought it was. So, therefore, I'm going to need to buy a vowel. Mm -hmm. Is there an E? Next! Uh, okay, Cam, your turn. Spin it. Ooh, you got a bankrupt. So next. Bing. Okay, Ben, your turn. Spin that wheel. All right, chance of the free spin. Give me an R. Next. Uh. Okay, Mark, back to you. So I'll have to spin. Ooh, chance of the car. Honk, honk. Okay. Let's try the S, please. Next! Mm, oh, well. All right, Cam, back to you. Spin. 600. Alright, Ben, back to you. It's just, oh, it's in the wheel. Chance of the pick a prize wedge. Oh, great. Is there an L? Next! Okay, Mark, back to you. Um, I'll try buying another vowel. Okay. Do we have an O up there? There is one O. There's your one O. Okay, and I am flat broke, so I'm gonna have to spin. Mm-hmm. Five hundred. Alright, Cam, back to you. Spin it. 
spin it, all right. 2,500. Okay, Ben. It's my turn, huh? Uh-huh. You know what? You know what? I'm gonna solve it. What is it? Fun bot. That is incorrect. Mm. Next! I go for it. Alright, well, um... I'll try to spin it. Oh, spin it, okay. Five hundred. Cameron, back to you. Yes, I have no choice but to stand. Five hundred. A B. There happens to be one B. Damn. You need to get one B on that board. That was five hundred dollars. There you go. Okay, Ben. Let's do that. Six fifty. Uh, boy, this is gonna be tough. Is there a C? Next. Mm. All right. I called. Okay, Mark. Yeah. Yeah. I have the used letter board. The C Oops. was already called, Ben. I'll spin. There's a chance of that car. Honk, honk. Oh boy. Um. Can I, have a, can I take a pee? That's going to the bathroom and vowels are remaining. Ding. Okay, Smart, your only option is either buy or solve. Um. Pinbot? That is correct. Yep. It's Pinbot. All right, you got that correct. Well, only gonna get the house minimum. Uh huh. But folks at home, we're gonna take a quick break before we get to our sponsors. We're gonna take a quick break because I gotta change my battery and I gotta take care of something. So, ciao for now. All right, folks, this is NG2C. We are back for part two of Mega Fortune here on the show. But before we get started with our sponsors, uh, Mark has happily won a car since he's won that round. Mark, you ready to wear your cars? Let's hear it. You've won yourself a 2014 Kia Canden Candenza. Ooh. This car is worth with all the doors, a nice radio, and it has great mileage with all the and it comes with a blah, 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 comes with a good mileage and a nice radio. Worth seventeen thousand three seventy. Okay, so Mr. Steve, what is his total after that? total is $19,370, 2000 for Ben, BJ, whatever, and nothing for Cameron, so. All right, but he'll, don't worry, we all will get some money soon. But now it's time for sponsors. If you all are enjoying Mega Fortune so far, then like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter and Instagram. Uh, Twitter is Mega Fortune Show, Instagram is Mega Fortune Game Show, and you can follow us at Facebook uh, www.facebook.com forward slash Mega Fortune Game Show to get our latest updates, feeds, uh, feeds, ask us for questions that you want to know about the show, then leave a comment on the Twitter page or ask whatever. Also, the layout that you see on my wheel is brought to you by Leafs Layouts. So please, uh, if you want to get layouts, he'll take any requests. Also, shows brought to you by Honey Buns, one of the best treats of Little Debbie's. Also, shows brought to you by, if you're a wrestling fan like myself is, Steve is, and Ben is, 
Thank and if you love wrestling figures as well, get them at wrestlingfigures.com or uh, Ringside Collectibles. I best recommend the basics or the elites because it's not a waste. Not a waste indeed. Also, shows brought to you by the Retron Three Video Game System. The video game system where you get to play three and one of NES, SNES, and Sega Genesis. Also, show is going to be brought to you by Wild Cherry Pepsi. New generation, but with a twist of a cherry flavor. But anyways, Mr. Ben? Yes? Take off the glasses. It's time for the jackpot round. <laughs> I knew you were going to say that. Mm-hmm. Anyways, let's begin our jackpot round right now. Category is going to be a song and artist. Mm-hmm. There you go, and he's going to be Mr. M All right, who's starting off this round? Mr. Uh, Mark, you're starting off. Get ready to begin. Wait, didn't he start the last round? Wait, no, no, Ben started the last one. Yeah, so oh. it's Mark who's starting off. Oh, okay. All right. Yay, oh, Double play token. Is there, I'll start with a B. There would be one B. Two of them, as a matter of fact. Two Bs. Oh, $1,000 for that. Okay, so let me put that uh, double play token on your podium. Get your two big Bs up there. And I just removed the puzzle again. There you go, Mark. Okay, let's get these slivers back in and spin the wheel. 650. A Y. Well, oh, you're happily going to get two of those, as a matter of fact. Okay, so you're going to get two Y's up there. Why? Because I said so. There you get two Y's. What would you like to do? Um, I'd like to spin the wheel, but... Wait, 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 wait. Before, before you spin it, I'm going to make this interesting and turn in the double play token. Okay, that's coming back to me. So whatever the wheel lands on is going to be double the money. Oh, 2500 Mark. It's going to be 5000 then if, since I use the double play, if I can find a T. You're going to get two of those. That's $10,000. So you got two T's up there. That was $10,000 worth of T's. A lot of money for that. And you have $12,300 right now. I certainly picked a good time to use the double play, didn't I? Yeah, you did. What would you like to do? Buy, spin, solve, or get me a sandwich. What would you like to do? Um... I'm trying to get you a sandwich after the game. Excellent. Okay, in the meantime, uh, let's buy an E. Okay, let's happily buy an E. Uh, you bought it, but none of them are up there. So you lost 250 for that, so we're going to move on to Cameron. So in other words, next! Exactly. Bankrupt. So next. <laughs> go ahead, Cam. I'm gonna go ahead, Ben. Spin that wheel. Don't let me down. You got a bankrupt on the ten thousand dollar watch. So right quickly back to Mark. Seven hundred. Let's try an S. An S? Yeah, you're gonna get one. Yeah. There you go. Let me bring my computer closer to me. There we go. Uh, okay. I'll 
false then. Mm hmm. Six fifty. Is there an N? Let me take a look here. No. No, there are no N's. So next, go ahead, Cam. All right, spin. You got a, you got it landed on the tab between in the middle of the invincibility star and the bankrupt. So we're gonna spin the wheel again. There we go, 700. Damn. Yeah, you're gonna have to get one. Damn. There you go. No, 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 wrong sound effect. <laughs> Smart. Smart indeed. Chance of the wild card. I don't get to say this very much. Is there an X? Yeah, you're going to get one X. I should. Oh, well. $1,200 uh, right now. Okay, there's your X. What would you like to do? One more time. Okay, one more time he asked. He's got $500. That wild card's on your podium. Chance of the Invincibility Star. Ooh. Or. Two of them. Dun, dun. Here, and that means vowels are left now. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, that was a thousand dollars for them ours that with that Invincibility Star. So your only option is either to buy or solve the puzzle. Let's solve it. All right. Mr. Roboto by sticks. That is correct. Dun 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 Don't want to make up the Mr. Robot Don't want to make up the Mr. Robot Don't want to make up the Mr. Robot Alright well Cameron picked up $2200 for that Plus the invincibility and the wild card 2000 for Ben still and Mark still leave with 19370 Uh huh well, anyways, let me get this category off the board. Y'all can just talk amongst yourselves. And we'll uh, we'll do that. Excuse you. Excuse that's, me. That, that, that's not a speech. I know it's not a speech. It's called a burp. <laughs> you know, I had the answer, Mr. Roboto, when, when I thought of it. Never heard of that song. <gasps> But then again, that's because I don't listen to music. Well, I listen to more music than you can ever handle. Yeah, the old... yeah I can tell that Jerry's in shock right now. So maybe I should start listening to music. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I think I will do rock and roll Jeopardy this summer then. That's a good idea. Anyways, the category is going to be a thing. The 50% round, the only round where uh, Roddy gets to take 50% money out of my wallet and my honey buns. <laughs> Cameron, you're starting off this round. Category is a thing. All right. $3,500 is on the wheel right now, so we got that. And speaking of 50%, you landed on the wedge. So if you screw up, you won't lose anything. If you manage to get that, you'll gain 50% by how much, Steve? I don't know. I don't know the whole details about this room. All right, well, well, since... He landed on it with no money, so I think it's $500 if he gets a correct letter. Yeah, we'll do that, yeah. Okay. All right. Teeth. You're gonna lo you, didn't, you ain't going to lose nothing, except you're going to go move on to Mason's turn. So next! Mm. Okay. Mr. Roboto. All right. You gotta lose a turn. So next. Mm. All right, Mark. Back All right, to you. Let's spin. 
one thousand dollars. That one is a bad amount for the double play either, but I'll take the. Well, except they already used the double play. Anyways, I'll take the N. You're gonna get one N. There you go. Okay, uh, I'll spin the wheel. Okay. 700. Alrighty. Does Mr. Host have an S for Mr. Mark? Mr. Mark's going to get three S's. Ooh. Yeah, seven hundred dollars indeed. Yeah, seven hundred times three is thirty-one hundred dollars, and he has thirty-one hundred. Oh, let me fix this. Good math, easy math too. Go to school, kids. There you go. Alrighty, yeah, uh, time to go to the dollar store and buy an E. Yeah, one, two, three. Okay, what would you like to do? Spin the wheel. Okay. Chance of the free vowel token. Um, let's put the G's up there, please. Yeah, you're going to get two of them G's, so that was $1,000 worth of G's up there, plus that money. <laughs> that sound means that vowels are left, so what would you like to do? Would you like to use the free vowel token lose none or solve the puzzle? I think I'll save the free vowel because I know what the solution to this is. Therefore, I'm going to solve the puzzle. Okay, what is it? Sega Genesis. That is correct. Dun, 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 dun. And yes, I know I put two eyes in there, so you already know about that. Okay. So, uh, Mr. Steve, so far? Uh, Mark is now up to $23,220 in his lead. Two uh, 2200 for Cameron and 2000 for Ben. Uh huh. Time for my favorite round at next. It's going to be the express round, the round where. If you land on it, thousand dollars. If you manage to get on the express, thousand for each. Still two fifty for vowels. Screw up, you get a bank. But here's the question: Will you board the <laughs> train? Anyways, it's going to be Mr. Ben starting off. Our next one's going to be an event. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm not finished with that yet. There you go. Okay, Ben, got to spin the wheel. Do it. Or solve the puzzle. Or better yet, get a chance at $3,500. Make oh. Try to make this count. I'm going to make it count. Give me an ass. Yeah, there are two of those. Well, yeah, that's going to be cool. I knew before I knew letters were on there. Well, Ben picked 
have seven thousand dollars for that, but that puts him back in it. He has nine thousand. Twenty two hundred so for Cameron, twenty three thousand two twenty so for Mark. Anything can happen. Anything can happen. Anything, anything will happen. Yeah. yeah I'm gonna go. Wow. Saint Patrick's Day. You know, I uh, think about wearing green for that day. Me too. You always should. <laughs> I always do. Thank you. All right. Well, anyways, here's our next one. Just imagine if I had landed on the express wedge. Ooh, let me see here. Okay, let me get the mystery wedges on there. And the four thousand dollars. Okay, well anyways, it's now time to get started with our mystery round. The category is gonna be the Skype Game Show Network. <laughs> we obviously know this is gonna be a game show, but here's a clue. It's gonna be coming soon. That's all I'm gonna say. Okay, and I start, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. And I still have the free gold token. Am I able to use it right away, or if you want to? All right, I'll go ahead and do that. Okay. Oh uh, yeah, you're gonna get three of those. Dun, dun, dun. <sighs> but you want to start off with that because you, since you use that, you still have no money. Pretty interesting. Nobody's ever done that before. Hey, I don't really give a care. Anything can happen here on May. If you want to use it right away, go ahead. I don't give a care. As long as you don't steal my honey buns, you're safe. I don't even eat honey buns, so... Alright, well, would you like to, your only option is either spin or solve. Well, in that case, I'll have to spin. My ear starts to hurt. Well, not really. Not really. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. And you got 650. R. Next! Mm. Okay, Cam, your turn. Spin it. Spin it, alright. Oh, it's a loser term, but you have that invincibility token. Would you like the invincibility star? Want to use that? Yeah. Okay, let's spin it again. Oh, chant five hundred dollars. And then. Uh, yeah. There's one. Or the. Okay, go ahead. Let's spin it again. Alright. Oh, it's a lose a turn, so next! Put that wild card up there. Okay, Ben, Please back to you. That wheel, Gary. Okay. Seven fifty. Okay, let's get two of them up there. Dun, dun. Two S's up going here. There you go. I'm going to solve it. I forgot to say no more vowels, but anyways, what is the solution? Seven keys. That is correct. Dun, 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 dun. Uh-huh. so mild-mannered, aren't I? Uh-huh. But anyway, Seven Keys was a former game show in the 60s, uh, based off of Shoots and Ladders, and that is a new game show that has come to SGSN, hosted by yours truly. Hmm. I will. Look out for that. that will be coming in a later announcement video about details, more about that. So um, that's gonna be coming soon. But anyways, we're y'all gonna get ready for our next toss-up question. Now this is gonna be sort of a long one, so I'm gonna repeat it twice. All right. Alright, fellas, you all ready for the next toss up? Yes, okay. I'm going to read it. Though. Yeah. Can I still buzz in during the question if you repeat it twice? Uh, no, I got to read the whole question. Twice? Okay, yeah. Just, just, okay, just, just to make sure. Alright, thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Michael Malley was the host of these two game shows and a panelist on this. Michael Malley was the host of these two game shows and a panelist on this. You gotta be specific when you give the host and the panelist. That was Cameron. Uh, he hosted Get the Picture and Nickelodeon Guts. Okay. And was a panelist on Figure It Out. You got $3,000. Yep. 
Good job. Oh, I actually deleted something. Not the puzzle, though. Let me fix this real quick. There we go. Okay. Time for a speed up in just a little second here. Category is going to be fun and games. <laughs> Time for a speed up, whatever the wheel land. And I forgot to take all the crap off the wheel. Silly me. Tricks are for kids. How lovely. <laughs> Exactly. And Gary, try licking your finger. Chuck Boy always did that. Okay. He did. Seventeen fifty a piece. And it's going to be the person who has the highest amount of money starting off. Letter. Letter. Oh, 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 I starting? Okay. Yes! <laughs> oh, shoot. Uh, okay, I forgot. High score starts to speed up. Okay, N. Uh huh, you're gonna get one N. You should know where that goes. But anyways, Mark, if you know the puzzle, just say if you don't, then pass. Okay. Ben. My turn. Yes. All right. Um, oh no, not Ben. Cameron. Excuse me. My bad. <laughs> oh, oh. Oops. My fault. D. Yeah, you're gonna get two of. Yeah, uh, not two. One. Did I steal your life? <laughs> you're a funny man. Go ahead, Ben. Now your turn. One thousand seven hundred fifty dollars a pop, huh? Uh, give me a T. A T. Let's see if there are C any T's. Next. <laughs> okay, an A. An A. Let me take a look one here. Yeah, you're gonna get one. Do we know where that goes? Yeah. Time to solve it, Mark. <laughs> I don't even know what the first word is or what the third word is. Pass. Okay, go ahead, Cam. <laughs> uh, S. You're going to get quite a few of those. You're going to get three of them. There you go. Chess. That is correct. Uh, oh. Okay. Da, 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 da. Good guess, Cameron. Very good guess. Okay, now Steve, who? All right. If Cameron didn't win the game, add his previous total and see if it'll be enough for him to get into the TOC. Well, it's ninety-four thousand, right? Now, let me look here again. Ninety-four thousand one eighty. Well, since those uh, that acid pick that did a mini got twelve thousand two hundred dollars total, so he's in. Cameron, you are in the tournament of champions. Not up to win the game. Not up to win the game though, but that's a good second place finish. Ten thousand five hundred for Ben, and the big winner is Mark. $23,220. Uh huh. So, Cameron, you managed to fill up that one spot. We need three more people for the season three TOC. You managed to fill that spot up. Good job. And by the way, Cameron, I have this to say. Yeah. Check the chat box. Okay, it's time for our bonus round. Right now, let me fix my pants. Well. You know what? I'm gonna fix my pants too. Okay. Okay. Alright, I like that. Uh, we needed that. <laughs> <laughs> that 
That was well said, Mark. Well said. <sighs> Night. Time for time for nightmares. <laughs> oh boy. But anyways, let me get the bonus we all set up here. Mark, you're gonna be starting off a bonus round. So we're gonna spin the wheel, see what it lands on. Thing is, he's already in the tournament champions as it is, just our return champion. That is a lot on the show. If you are in the TOC, you are allowed to be back as a uh, return champ. Right. You landed on the N in money. Okay. Ding. There's your envelope. Category is going to be of things, so, uh, go ahead, give me your three more constants and a vowel. Okay. So there's R C L N to start with just an R. Alright, let's, well, we're obviously going to need more information than that. Uh, let's try a G. That's one. M. That's two. P. That's three. And an A, please. Okay, you're going to get little help here. Yeah, that's all your help you're going to get. Just that A. So I'm going to give you ten seconds on the clock starting. So just talk it out. If you know the puzzle, just, just talk it out. Ten seconds on the clock starting now. Well, that was a hard one that I gave. And what was it? Here was a solution. Hmm. Interesting. Oh. X-ray. Oh. Oh. Really? <laughs> Mark, you lost out on the car. Oh. Well, that's okay. You already got a car. <laughs> uh-huh. Well, if I tell you, then it will ruin for the rest. It was uh, 1974 Chevy. Oh. Uh -huh, but I'm not going to give the money amount. Mark, I think you tried. But we're going to keep that car until uh, somebody wins it. But anyways, that's going to do it for our game, ladies and germs. So let's get to our ending credits, shall we? Yes, let's. This has been an NG2C Network production. Copyrights go to Sony Entertainment. All rights are reserved. The wheel's been spinning your way on Meg Fortune. Like, subscribe for more action, fun, and games.